All right, everyone, let's get it. It's Ian K back again with another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews. This time headed into Jack in the Box because it looks like Chili's back on the menu. And now it's part of an all new promo burger too. That's right, so stay tuned because they're Chili Cheeseburgers up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. I need Jack back to help you. Yeah, Peep This Out, can I get that new Chili Cheeseburger combo, please? Regular or, or double? Oh yeah, actually, I noticed you've got the double there. Let's let's do the double. That sounds good. Okay. And you want it small, medium, or large? Uh, just small is fine. Regular fries or curry? Uh, let's do uh, let's do curly fries. Why not? And what kind of drink? Uh, Diet Coke, please. Thank you for you. That's it. Oh, Brian, eight oh nine. Thank you. Great. Thank you much. All right. Very cool. It looks like they've brought back their loaded and sauced fries as well, which I've done in the past. Take a look at that playlist popping up on your screen right now for all that loaded curly fry goodness. Hey, good. How you doing today? Yes, the devil. Uh, no, that's fine. Awesome. Thank you. All right. No, no worries. I appreciate you. It's all good. Stay frosty. We'll see ya. Bye bye. All right, guys. Let's peep this out. So here we go with the double chili cheeseburger combo here at Jack in the Box. Starting off with a quick shot of the combo itself, featuring curly fries in this case and a small drink, but we're going to be focusing on the main star of the show. Feast your eyes on that double chili cheeseburger. Looking pretty nice, guys, with a decent amount of goodness right there in the middle of those buns. And that bun sure is pretty soft. Let's pop it and take a look underneath it, and it looks like there is no shortage of chopped onions along with that chili, guys. There's a lot of it on the top of this bun here right now, and that's all sitting on top of two beef patties, as you can see, along with melted American cheese. Let me see if I can split that meat for you and see if we can get a little bit of cheese pull action. Looks like just a little bit, not too bad, but they are value sized patties. Let's take a look underneath that. Looks like nothing on the bottom, but as you can see, a very healthy amount of the good stuff here, guys. Chili, cheese, onions, and beef together inside of a bun. Let's see if the flavor is going to deliver on this one. It's the double chili cheeseburger here at Jack in the Box. Let's peep out this flavor. All right, so it looks like I didn't really think this one out too well because I'm about to go into a double chili cheeseburger wearing white. So I'm going to have to be very careful with this one. But let me just say a huge shout out to Jack right now for the burger diaper. This one absolutely needs it. And considering what I've got here right now, it is absolutely welcome, guys. There is no shortage of chili and chopped onions on this along with the cheesy goodness right there. This should be pretty awesome, I'm thinking. All right, so before I hopefully confirm that goodness for you, and like always, if you guys are fans of high quality, delicious looking food reviews, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to tap that bell icon so you can be notified as soon as brand new content drops every week. Guys, here we go, the double chili cheeseburger. My first time having a chili cheeseburger over here at Jack in the Box. Let's give it a shot. Mmm. That is a lot of chili. Mmm. There is some very rich Tex-Mex spicing going on with this chili right now, guys. I can't tell if there's really beans in this or not because I'm really getting the vibe that there is, but it's very meaty on top of the beef itself. And of course, the crunchiness of the onions, it's very, very hearty. And guys, with the value patties being the size that they are, I'd recommend doing the double. And as you guys can see real quick here, it makes a difference because these thin patties would be just that, very thin, but naturally the double really is the ideal amount with this. Let's go for another bite, not bad so far. Yeah, that's a hearty, beefy chili flavor with this one, and it stands out well above the beef patties themselves, which are not too bad in the flavor department, guys. A little on the drier side, but the moisture from the chili is making up for it, along with the melted cheese. But obviously, with the onions in there for added crunch and actually added moisture, it's a very nice combination. And again, this double really is the way to go, considering the size of the beef patty so far here. Very, very tasty. Well, I guess it wasn't really too surprised going through the drive through seeing that they have their loaded and sauced fries back again with chili fries being one of the options, which I actually had a lot of fun checking out. And again, take a look at the playlist in the upper right hand corner of your display for proof of that. It's a good time for sure. But naturally having a burger promo that has that chili now, it's a beautiful situation. And again, I'm very glad for this burger diaper on the very back here, guys. Let's go for another bite and keep going in. Mmm, man, that is beefy. Yeah, I'm definitely a diced onion type of guy, and there sure is a lot of them on this one here, guys. I only wish there was a little bit more throughout, maybe having a little bit of the chili on the bottom. But again, I think that would have been more of a slip slide situation there. But considering how many onions are on this right now, and they're not the slivered onions, these are like chopped pieces of onions, guys. Pretty nice. Let me see if I can actually pull this back for you, give you an idea of what I am looking at. Look at that on the inside. Very hearty, very messy, but I gotta say the flavor is off the chart in terms of the flavor of the onions on top of the chili. You gotta have a little diced onion with the chili for that crunch and just the overall flavor that it adds. But guys, beautiful situation on this. All right, so let me go for one more quick bite of this one and then we'll finish this one out after the rating. But guys, a very lovely situation with the chili over here at Jack in the Box and I'm so glad to finally have this in the portfolio of content that I have from them because guys, 
it's just delicious chili. And I have to admit, the fact that those Tex-Mex spices are really standing out, the onions are a beautiful touch. I'm glad they're not very tiny minced pieces of onion. They're actually large, nice pieces. I'm really digging that, guys. And the quality, again, of the beef, even though it's a little on the drier side, is actually helped along because of the chili. And I think I see why they do that. But along with everything else here, not bad for what you're getting. The curly fries, the drink, the value of what you're getting for $6.99 here on the West Coast, not bad. One more bite and we'll close this one out. All right, so let me try and do this carefully 360 without the burger diaper. And as you can see, no shortage of those onions, guys. I am really loving that. And again, the size of the beef patties being what they are, a more value sized, you wanna do the double. It's gonna give you more of that denseness that you're looking for. Obviously more onions out the back. The cheese is decent. It's a little lost in the mix with the cheese, but the overall flavor of the chili is the main star of the show with this one. But guys, a lovely situation. And again, if you loved onions like I do, you're gonna dig this. This is pretty nice. Order on Uber Eats, Postmates, and Grubhub. So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the all new double chili cheeseburger here at Jack in the Box a pretty rock solid nine out of 10. Now, the only way that I can really see to improve upon this one, and as always is the case with most of these promo burgers, is maybe making the cheese just a little bit more pronounced because as it stands, that is a total chili showcase, guys, as it should be. The quality of the chili is amazing. I just wish the cheese itself stood out just a little bit more, but guys, the onions coming up on the back end more than makes up for that extra flavor and the overall togetherness of everything in that burger. And like I said throughout this review, you got to do the double because a single patty is just not going to do it for you. And you can tell that by the size of the value patties on this. Very, very solid and an easy recommendation, especially if you like chili burgers. Okay, so now the obvious couple of questions. First off, do you love chili burgers? I have a feeling if you've made it this far into the review, you probably do. And if that is the case, are you going to be giving this one a shot? Drop some comments down below. If you've got Jack in the Box in the area, how excited are you to give this chili cheeseburger a shot over here? And are you going to do the double? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Hour Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Nice one on this one, Jack, but I'm kind of surprised you don't have a triple variant available officially on your menu. I mean, if it was there, I absolutely would have done it. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.